So I want to see how the X5M looks with the fog lights on. And Donington Grey starts to be like one of my favorite BMW colors. Really deep and nice. And it looks quite mean with these fogs on. It, it looks like, like even the fogs are LEDs as well. What do you think, Aaron? Are the fogs LED as well? They look almost as bright. Oh, they look difficult to say. Yeah, it's really look super sharp. Mm -hmm. Wow, it, uh, it gives a total, it's a completely different look with the fog lights on. Oh, yeah. It looks crazy. <laughs> really cool. So mean. And what I noticed also uh, was that the air outlets on the side are not fake. They dis distribute the air out here. From here to let the hot air out from the brakes. So if I do like this, if I put see camera here, we do some revving. So, uh, it's Donington Grey, it really blends in super nice with this car and, and with this uh, interior. And if, if I like you open up the, the roof, the moon roof, do that right away, a little fast here, like that, you will see, you will see how it lights up the interior. Uh, from outside. Let's see. Yeah, I can see. Oh, you see the bucket seats. Really hardcore. Looks like the X5 Le Mans that did with Hans Joachim Stuck that did 750 on Nuburing Nordschleife. But the fog lights on. <laughs> These times come back when fog lights look cool. They're back with the X5M. Anyway, say hi to Ferry going to Baltic States from Sweden. Around 10 years ago, this boat, uh, similar boat, sunk with over uh, 900 people died. Majority Swedes, I believe. So it's a monument here over the families who died on that boat. Only I think like 100 or yeah, between 50 and 100 survived. Uh, survival rate was capped a little bit by the eat barrier, the, the guys picking up the uh, people from shoppers, uh, the conscripts. Terrible, tragic in Sweden, which only can maybe can be compared to the tsunami in Thailand, where like around 1,000 Swedes, Swedish people died also. Anyway, that's all for now. Let's do some more sounds.